All right, look what just came in the mail here from Bulbhead. It's the Hurricane Fur Wizard. This is the lint brush that's reusable and self-cleaning and supposedly designed for pet hair. So let's crack this open and see what's inside. All right, I've got this cracked open. It comes with the full-size fur wizard and the mini version. Both of them work on the same principle. When you pull it out, there's an arrow here that tells you which direction you're supposed to move it because there is a different texture. If you go this way, it feels smooth. If you go this way, it feels rough. The instructions are pretty simple. There isn't much to it. Basically, move in the direction of the arrow. Don't rinse it underwater. Insert the lint brush into the container every time you're using it and empty out from the bottom whenever you're done. I've got four pets and my house has pet hair all over it, so this is definitely something that I'm going to use and see how well it really works. All right, with four pets in my house, there's so many things I can try, I don't even know where to start. But I'm going to start with this pillow that has some of my Chihuahua's hair on it, because that's gonna be probably the easiest thing to start off with. So I've got my fur wizard, the arrow points that direction, so let's see how it goes. Well, that took it off pretty well. Here's the other side, even worse. If you can see that, yep, look at all that. Let's try it some more. Okay, the pillow is pretty well cleaned off, and we have got pet hair on the fur wizard. Now let's see what happens when I stick it in here. I don't, I mean, it's not 100% off. Some, some came off, not all of it. I mean, most of it came off, I think. Okay. I guess they're not supposed to expect 100%, but yeah, I think most of it came off. First impression, works pretty well, let's keep trying. I've seen commercials in the past for lint removal devices where they see a businessman in a suit and tie, I'm not gonna wear a tie, but a businessman in a suit who gets lint on his suit and he wipes it off. So I'm gonna try to duplicate that by putting a suit on and let Bailey in here play with her wearing the suit and then see how bad the pet hair is and how well the fur wizard works removing the pet hair. So let's try that. Come here, come here, come here, sit, sit. Good girl. girl. All right, come here. Crazy dog. Yeah, good girl. Good girl. Oh. Okay, sit. Good girl. Okay, good girl. Come here. Come here, good girl. Okay. All right, let's see the damage here. Oh, yeah. Look at all that pet hair already. That's not good. Oh, look at that. Oh, terrible. Look at that. Oh, no. I got a business meeting in half an hour. Oh, no. Do a couple of these. Can you see that? Ooh. I guess when it starts leaving the hair behind, it's time to swipe it through the base. Yeah, that's a lot of dog hair. Probably shouldn't have done that. That's your work, Bailey. You did it. The instructions say not to use it directly on your pets. That smells like you, huh? No, don't lick that.
That was a pretty aggressive test, but I think the Fur Wizard is doing a pretty good job. So, so far, I think the Fur Wizard is passing my test. I first saw the original Fur Wizard months ago. It wasn't called the Hurricane Fur Wizard, it was just called the Fur Wizard. But it was rebranded by Bulbhead under the Hurricane name, and that seems to have resonated with consumers because this is a hot product right now, and in my test, worthy of all the attention it's getting. All right, this has been used as a pet blanket. As you can see, it's been folded right there, and that is all pet hair right there. So let me see how well the Fur Wizard does with a larger job like that. Yeah, in the direction of the arrow. picking it up pretty good. Let's see how much of that comes off. Quite a bit of it. I would say most of it came off. Look at all that. Most of this, that came off pretty quick, I must say. Look at all that. I mean, the discoloration isn't going to change, but I got pretty much all the pet hair up in just a matter of seconds. So I think it worked pretty well. Here's a black thermal shirt that's really bad at picking up dog hair. So I got some dog hair on it. This is Golden Retriever and Chihuahua hair, and I'm going to see how well the Fur Wizard does on this. I might actually do a section with a mini to see how that works. Let's see how the Mini does. Now keep in mind the Mini, the brush itself doesn't have two sides and it doesn't actually remove from the base. But the rest of the principle is the same. When you get some pet hair on there, slide it back in, slide it back out. So really I think the Mini does about as well, it just might be smaller and take a little bit longer. But so far the Hurricane Fur Wizard is living up to expectations, which is rare for me to say, but it's true. Now that I've been using this for a while, it's probably time to see how much fur is collected in the bottom. So let's open it up and see what's inside. Oh, look at that. That's quite a bit of fur that came off of clothing and pillows and blankets. Still a bit inside. I'm sure you can't get all of it out, but that's, cool. that's quite a bit. So in the end, the Hurricane Fur Wizard, to me, lives up to the expectations. It's simple to use, it works about as advertised, and it comes with a mini version that you can take with you. It's actually one of the better bulbhead products that I've reviewed recently. Have you used the Hurricane Fur Wizard or something like it? Let me know what you think in the comments below. And please subscribe for more As Seen on TV product reviews from me, James White, with Freakin' Reviews.